In this tutorial, I am going to discuss a programming question reverse a string. So in this problem, we have to write a code to reverse a string and also the input string given as an array of characters. And for solving this problem, we don't have to allocate extra space for another array. We have to solve this problem by modifying the input array in place using constant space. And uh, let's see some examples. So in the first example, given this input array of characters, and when we reverse this input array of characters, we get this output where O is moved here and H is moved at this index, E will move at this index, L will move at this index and this L remain as it is. So this is the output. And in the second example, given this array of characters and when we reverse them, we get this output. Now this is the problem statement. And now let's uh, discuss how we can solve this problem by using constant space. Let's see how we can solve this problem using two pointers. So the idea here is to use two pointers start and end. So a start pointer points at zeroth index and end pointer points at array length minus one. And then what we do is we swap the character present at this index with the character present at this index. And when we swap, so this O comes at this index and H comes at this index. Then we increment the value of start pointers. So start pointers move at this index and we decrement the value of end pointers. So end pointer move at this index and then we swap the characters. So L moves here and then uh, E moves here. We continue this process until the value of start variable is less than the value of end variable. And after this step, when we increment the value of start variable, its uh, new value is 2 and we decrement the value of end variable and its new value is 2. So both both variable have equal value. So we came out of this loop and we don't have to return anything uh, from from this method. So we don't return anything and we have reverse an array of characters in place. And now let's see the code. So in the code, I have declared two variable start and end and their initial value is zero and array length minus one. So I have already explained. So initially start will point at zeroth index and end will points at array length minus one. Then we run this loop until the value of start variable is less than end. Here is the logic to swap character present at start index with the character present at end index and it is very straightforward. So we take one time variable which is of character type and in this time variable I assign the character which is present at start index. So let's say H and now at this index we uh, assign the value which is present at end index. So let's say O and then at this index we assign uh, the value which is present in tamp. So H and after that I increment the value of start pointer and decrement the value of end pointer. So start variable and end variable. So start will point at this index and end will point at this index. And again, we do the same process and we keep doing this process until the value of start variable is less than end variable. In this way, we have reverse an array of characters in place. So now let's talk about its time and space complexity. So its time complexity is O n and its space complexity is O1. So we are using constant space. We are using uh, two pointers and it does not depends upon the input size. So that's why the space is constant. So that's it for this video tutorial. For more such programming videos, you can subscribe our YouTube channel. You can visit our website, which is https colon slash slash webrewrite.com. And also if you know any other approach to solve this problem please let us know through your comments thanks for watching this tutorial